Hi, my name's Gemma. Like many other NHS staff at the moment, I'm facing the situation of either have the COVID-19 vaccination or risk losing my job. So I've been allowed to work for the last two years without a COVID-19 vaccination. And even in the beginning, when it was obviously very unknown, we didn't know what we were dealing with, what we were facing. I worked many occasions without any PPE. I put myself at risk, I put my son at risk, I put my family at risk, but I still turned up to work and cared for people and did my job and completed my shifts. I've gone from being called an NHS hero to now when it gets to April this year, I'm suddenly gonna be deemed a risk and unsafe to work with patients. I can work up until that point, but once it's April, I'm then all of a sudden a risk and unsafe to continue doing my job. We're not talking about a vaccination which stops the spread of COVID-19. It doesn't stop you getting it. So I'm really, really struggling to understand why I'm suddenly going to be deemed a risk when it doesn't stop, like I say, the spread or stop you from catching it. I really, I can't understand that. The vaccine is still in a trial until 2023 and there is no long-term data available for it. So for me, I've got my own reasons why I don't want it, but that is definitely something that is a factor in why I don't wish to have it. I should be allowed to make an informed decision about my own body. I shouldn't be being forced or coerced into having anything that I don't want, either have the jab or lose my job. That isn't a decision, that's not a choice, that is complete coercion. I'm standing by what I believe in and what I know is right for me. I'm always encouraging my son to stand up and voice things that he believes in and what he knows is right. And this is a situation where I'm having to show that. Unfortunately, it's at the detriment of me losing my job. But like I say, I've got to stand by what I believe in and also what I'm teaching him as well. Just please think about the mandating of this vaccine because it won't just affect NHS staff. I do really worry about the way that things will head if this does go through for everybody else. Like I say, not just NHS staff.